time for another special edition of Weekly News. Now, this time we have a big event coming up in the Tri-Cities. We have Mark Williams here. He is the new event director, well, as of the last couple of years, for Tri-City Water Follies. Mark, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. For people who maybe don't know what Tri-City Water Follies Boat Races is, Mark, give us a brief rundown of what to expect. Oh, wow. Well, um, first of all, it's a, it's a community event. It's family fun. Um, you know, we're super excited. We, we've got lots of boats. There's boat racing. There's, uh, there's, there's the new and the old. So we've got vintage boats. We've got the, the new hydroplanes. Um, you know, we got we got a new boat that's uh, that's pretty quick, um, and it's sponsored by our our sponsor Apollo. So that's it's really cool, and it's a sharp looking boat. Um, and then we have the air show, and, and luckily for us, you know, uh, this is the A10's farewell tour, so we've got the uh, A10 going to be in town, and we're really excited by that. So you know, we got an air show, we got food trucks, we got boat racing. You know, we got a river, we got a park. I don't know how it gets any better. Two parks, Pasco side or Kennewick side? Two parks, you know, Pasco and Kennewick. We're at Wade Park and uh, Columbia Park, so we're really excited about it. Which side is your favorite? Uh, if I was buying a ticket, um, I would probably go to Wade Park. I really like all the grass and the way it goes down into the water. Um, but if, uh, you know, because of the way it works and the amount of people and the excitement, we have, we have more stuff on the Kennewick side. So the Kennewick side is really exciting for me. We got more vendors, there's more food trucks. Okay, we just have a little bit of time left. So we talked about boat races, the air show, lots of people, the community coming together. Talk to me a little bit about these special hydroplane boats. Again, for people who don't know, how do they work? What do they do? They basically skim across the water. I mean, the unlimiteds are just, you know, they're being held on the water by a few things. It, it's it's like, like bends almost for most people that wouldn't understand. Um, but it, you, you're, they're skimming across the top of the water, two, three inches above the water, um, you know, at, at up to 164 miles an hour, you know, a, a lap speed anyway. So they, they can go 200 plus miles an hour on a straightaway. We have one of the, the bigger tracks. We have a very fast track. Um, because of the way our track is set up, we've got great viewing. And then the wind doesn't affect us as much as it does some of the other races. So the, the water stays fairly calm. It's the fastest thing on the water. All right, certainly a sight to see. Well, Mark, thank you so much. The action again is Friday, Saturday, Sunday is when the Columbia Cup is handed out.